Uh, hey Garrett, it is Ryan here. I'm going to make a video for you teaching you how to edit these boxes, uh, these text boxes on the long point site. Uh, so the thing to remember is that this area here, that is all footer area one. This area down here is all footer area two. So when we go to our widgets area, you will see footer area, first footer area, there's four text boxes, second footer area, another four text boxes. So let's say we want to edit, let's go to the site and we'll pick one out. Uh, recent topic three. Now these text boxes can be edited, but they can't be deleted and you can't add new ones or it will really mess up the code. So recent topic three, let's change that to something else. And we're gonna go back to the widgets area and then to the first footer, because if you remember, recent topic three is in the first footer, the top footer. So when I click on this arrow on the side, it'll open it up. Recent topic three, we're gonna say is uh, bird watching. And then we can put any description we want here the only thing is if you go too long then it it might spill out onto the rest of the page so uh, let's just type anything here all bird watchers should be excited for the change in the season and migrations uh, so okay we've got our little description and then this link is the where it says link dot 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 that is the text and I'm gonna just open up a new window here so you can see what I'm talking about long points uh, do, 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 do. that's this link dot 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 link dot 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 so when I change this text between these two little angle brackets that's what's going to be clickable so I'm gonna say learn more and then I can add whatever bird watching let's go bird watching I don't know Toronto and Southern Ontario bird uh, birding I guess they call it so you can link to anything you want. So I'm going to copy this link if it's on another website and I'm going to put it here between these brackets. So there's a bracket here and there's a bracket here. You can't touch those. You need to paste it right there. So I'm pasting that link in and then I save it. And then I'm going to go to this and refresh. So I refresh the page and now it says bird watching all bird watchers blah 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 that's what I wrote and there's my learn more link uh, if you want this learn more to be on another line you have to put in another special thing which is angle bracket sorry you have to do that over here angle bracket slash br slash and that'll give you a break and let's save that and see if it fixed it so this is code you're doing some code now you're officially a web designer so I refreshed it and now look learn more is on one page and it all looks pretty so I'll leave that BR in there so you can remember what that remember what that looks like if you ever need to do that again and uh, now let's close this one up. So I just hit that arrow again, and we're gonna try to change something in the resource area. So you've, I've already done a photo contest, resource area, sorry, there's a bus. Obnoxiously loud, stupid bus. Uh, let's say I wanna change resource area four. So like I said, we can't delete these things, but we can edit them. So we're gonna go to widget, widgets, second footer area is where all the resources are. I'm gonna twirl that area out. There's resource area four. That's the one I want to change because it says so right here. And then I'm going to go uh, fishing. That's my new title. Or sorry, that 
that's my titles up here. Forget what I just said. Fishing. That's my title. And you can say here's the description. Fishing licenses. I think that's how you spell licenses. Are available at any local uh, licensing bureau. I don't know how to spell bureau, so I'm going to say shop. Uh, inquire with uh, or inquire on our contact page or something like that. I don't know. And then if you want to link to something on the site, you can go to about and then actually let's go to the the FAQs. Maybe you have something about fishing in the FAQs. So all I'm doing is I'm grabbing this link, copying it, and then going back to this. Uh, and I'm just going to change that to refer to our FAQ section for more info. And then I'm going to leave this link just the way it is because I don't care if that says link or not and I'm just going to paste this between the quotes paste doesn't matter that it broke the line like that I, I knew I had this in the right place this is just the program wanting all of this stuff to be on the same line because this is like one big long word it thinks so if you get you know you paste your this looks nice and then you paste your link in and it drops it down to the next line. Don't worry about that. It'll still work fine and I'll prove it to you. Saving. Back over to this. And we're going to go to the home page again by clicking the logo. It's going to reload. And at the bottom now it says fishing. And see, oh, there's a little, see this? The link is right up against the period. If you don't want that, it's very easy to fix. This is where it's happening. There's the period. You put a space. You save it. Go back over. I'm going to refresh that. Command R refreshes your browser. And look, fishing. Fishing licenses are available at any local licensing shop. Refer to our FAQ section for more info. And then you click your link, and it should take it to should take you to your FAQ section on the site. There you are. Frequently asked questions. So it's very easy to do. You shouldn't have any trouble. Uh, watch this video as many times as you need to to get it all figured out. Just remember the big rule here is in these areas, you never hit the delete button. If you delete these, it's major problems.